For more updates, click on subscribe and click on bell button for latest notifications. Hi friends, welcome to Tech ARK IT YouTube channel. My name is Ravi. In this video session, we are going to see that how to write your first uh, playbooks. So how we can write these playbooks to um, write an Ansible to do something. Okay, so how we can write the game playbooks and what is an ML language or AML language and how you use that language to write your playbooks. So this is simply key value pairs written in a right alignment. So that's what we can say about the playbook. So let's see that. So if you if you are not in a developer or if you are not in a uh, code writing expert or something like that so don't worry about it this ml language is very very simple if you spend a few minutes on the writing this playbook so you will learn it simply like share comment and subscribe so let's see this so So first of all, so what is this YAML? It another markup language. Example say that if you have an HTML, so a hypertext markup language. In similar way, so all playbooks are written in a ML. It another markup language. So this language is very very simple and a human readable format. So where it is very easy to write the playbooks and you can do a number of programming like number of lines of code you can write in these uh, playbooks so it's very easy to do it but there is only one thing you have to concern about the whenever you are writing the playbook is that that whatever the code you are writing it should be in a rightly aligned so if you do that like then the playbook plays a very good um, simple and very good option for you but if you misplace the alignment of the playbook then the play is going to be gives an error saying that there is something error on the line number one line number two something like that so but I will show you that how you will align the playbook and what is the method you have to use here so the first of all the playbook starts with three iPhones, iPhone, iPhone, iPhone. Comments. So, if you want to uh, write any comments in between of the playbooks, like uh, just like an, uh, this is what the uh, notes in in between the playbook. You can just uh, start the line with the ash, then write the content so that that is in a comment. So it does not execute on the playbook. So members of list. Example say that if you want to make a list. On the uh, playbook then you can start that with the iPhone okay so iPhone fruits then under that you can write that uh, banana like uh, tomato whatever it is right so just like in a list but the playbooks whenever the playbook is ends is a dot 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 so this begin with iPhone iPhone or ending with the dot 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 that does not matter for the playbook if you do not write iPhone 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 or dot 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 at the end the playbook will execute fine but as an a if you want to make an a professional playbooks or if you want to become an a professional on the playbooks so make use of good habits whenever you are writing the playbooks so key value pairs so this, this key value pair like just start then a key and its value separated by the colon okay so do not forget uh, the colon in between so that if you forget that then it not a key value pair so it may be end up with the errors okay do not do not forget about this and uh, there is an a uh, in the playbook there is a called in a list and there is called as an a dictionary so how we can write make use of them so let's see that and here is some example I am going to show you uh, this is what the example is so 
here is the uh, example how we can write the playbook here so that uh, playbook starts with three iphone signs and uh, specify where you want to execute these tasks example say that if you want to execute on all of the host or the few of the host or few of the group servers are only in one server so what what you want to specify you can specify over that or you can also specify out of the playbook so the you can in in general you can write the playbook then after that also you can specify the inventory file and the group whenever you are executing the playbook okay or you can also uh, specify in the playbook itself so that it makes so the playbook is combination of plays and tasks so the play can have number of tasks okay the playbook will have number of plays in the sense so in this uh, example here i have single play and uh, multiple tasks so that way you can make a multiple task in a single play so the single play play have a name like this is what the play and task has a different tasks so it's a combination of playbook so here if you want to write this playbooks here you can just specify that the alignment should be perfect so whenever you are writing here here it should be in a four spaces starting from here to here so there is a four spaces when you are you when you would like to specify the this like this uh, tasks colon then after that from here to here there is a four space one two three four so here there is a four spaces should be there so you should remember always that one so that your place work, works perfectly fine and whenever you also have this one from here to here you have to have the four spaces okay so do not forget about that one then your place will be perfect so example here i have a given some example right how we can write this uh, place here in a few in a few rules you need to follow is when you want to include a colon in statement you have to enable quotations statement you have to enable the quotations from start to ending shown as example here so this is what you have to do it so example say that if you want to write the quotation here example say iphone name so there is no space which is not correct iphone space name which is correct and uh, immediately you have to provide the colon here then there is a space after that you have to add the quotation marks in that you have to write the statement okay then you can still write the path as like this so if you want to write specify some paths you can specify example say that c windows i would like to say i want to copy some data over there i want to specify the path you can also do this way windows path okay tell further on writing ansible variables and this is this is the next class uh, we are going to see that ansible variables but here i would like to say how you can write the variables and not to write this way okay so this is what you have to write the variable content okay not this way so remember these rules whenever you are writing the playbooks it's very very important so if you practice this playbooks writing then you will understand that how carefully you have to write whenever you are writing the playbook so what is the uh, alignment you have to follow okay let's see on the practical we will write a simple playbook and execute it how it works so this is our ansible master here is our ansible uh, playbook is then what i am going to do here it is that i am going to say that mkdir slash playbooks so now and i just go into the playbooks slash playbooks so here i am just going to write a simple playbook called ping test okay let's be i am i am just using an vi editor you may use any of the editor like a nano editor or whatever the editor you would like to if you want to write on the windows you can use the notepad plus place or you can also use any of the um, editors text editors which you like it maybe lime editor otherwise anything 
okay but here i'm using a name we i am so let's say that ping test dot yml so you can also use any uh, extension here that is called uh, yml or yaml so anything you can use i am using so as starts the playbook iphone 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 and uh, start the name i would like to say here the name is going to be a uh, fast playbook ping test okay so i would like to say that plus playbook ping test here so here i am going to say that uh, specify the host where i would like to execute on all of the servers as i know that i already have this group on our uh, configuration simple configuration file so i am not using any extra inventory files here so i am going to specify the tasks here so the tasks say the task name is ping test and uh, ping is my command so i would like to go and each and every server ping the server and come back to me give the ping result here so that's what the playbook is and if you want to end the playbook with the uh, ending then you have to use dot 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 so this is what the playbook is completed a simple playbook which executes the ping command on all of the servers and get back the result for us so this is what the play let's execute the play with play sorry unseeable iphone playbook and specify the playbook file name let's see this how this playbook works so now i'm just executing here our past playbook so our playbook got executed successfully is there any thing is changed do i really do anything here so no i did not do anything on here so first of all it goes and gather the facts of the each and every server so because i did not say gather the fact is equal to no then on the playbook so it gather the details of the host and um, it pings the test so it pings all of the uh, servers and says all of the servers are okay so then it did it did do anything changes no there is no change on any of the servers because it i did not specify the playbook to change anything here so that's what our the fast to play is example say here uh, i would like to give you an a, a simple example here how the playbooks can give you an errors example say here while i am writing this play so i'm just uh, misaligning the playbook by giving an a space so okay now i would like to execute this unseeable play book and uh, ping test so it says that the syntax error loading in a yaml mapping values are not allowed so this is this is so and so error something like this and it's going to give you an error saying that here is what you have did the mistake so this is how you will get the playbook error whenever you misalign the playbook so what i'm going to do is that i'm just going to align this playbook correctly and uh, try to execute it again okay unseeable playbook and uh, ping test okay do remember don't panic okay if you get an error just look at up the error message what it is saying and correct the alignment you will your play is going to play don't worry about it so in the next session we are going to see the about ansible variables how we can specify the variables on the playbook and write little extended playbook on the next session that's about guys thanks for watching stay tuned please subscribe to the channel and share it to your friends um, who are willing to learn this ansible course or ansible automation
please follow us on social networking site uh, one is uh, facebook the facebook page name is uh, at linux arkit uh, you can click on this button here and click like page so that you can follow us on facebook the next one is instagram uh, instagram name page name is arkit dot co dot in click on follow button to follow me and uh, twitter if you have any questions on uh, subject line or if you have anything you can just tweet me at a ravikumar 48 so i will reply you most on the tweet back for anything related if you want to latest articles on my website so here is my website details and email address details you can reach me over here